So this is the first day. It's day one, day. bro. Day one. Back day. Day one for Brownie Martin. It's day one. Day one. It's a day one. Hey, this is like first time in a couple weeks you've done a workout video. Yeah. He's back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't promise him too much right now. I've been back, bro. You been back? I just gave. I gave. Uh, I gave everyone some time to. Don't hit your head, bro. That, bro. Don't hurt. Don't hurt. You You're lucky we didn't film that. You should have caught that, bro. You should have. Don't shoot, uh, or don't let a friend shoot you with a salt gun. Salt. A salt gun, literally. Like, see this in like my sodium. Oh wow! Looks gun. like you got a hickey. Does it? Yeah. What? Uh oh. Uh oh. Damn, it does. Wow. Anyways, don't let a friend shoot you with a salt gun in the neck and it'll look like you have a hickey. You got an intro. Um, yeah. Well, this is the intro. This is a, this is the new intro. Oh, this is your hickey? I mean, uh, oh, hickey. Your gun one? Let me see. Where's that? Oh, shit, bro. Yeah. Don't. Look. You want me to show you the salt gun? Sure. We'll shoot, we'll shoot you in the neck. Yeah, you're good, bro. Come on. So check this out. There's salt in this gun. Yeah. See this? Yeah. All right? Okay. All right, come on. Come on, we gotta be we're gonna be twins, bro. Does it hurt? Is it bad? For like one second. Hey, this will be the, the thumbnail. I okay, shot look, Steve. He's ready, he's ready, he's ready. Yeah, I shot Steve, right? Hey, but aim good, bro. I got you, I got you. You got bad aiming skills. No, 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 I got you. Wait, 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 wait. Is this the thumbnail? Wait, 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 wait. Go. I'll make sure I'm far enough away. Ah, that shit hurts. Ah, oh, that shit hurts. <laughs> that hurt? It does hurt. For a dude. second. Ah, you, you good? Steve, Steve. Yo, he's a savage for that. Yeah, Steve's a savage. Damn, bro. You good? Nah, I'm good. I just, the reason why I want to do it, because I want to show that he, it's not a hickey. He's gonna help me prove it's not a hickey. Oh. Uh, Watch, he's not, it's not. They're, not, they're gonna say yeah, it's a hickey to me now. My mom's gonna be like, ¿Qué es eso? ¿Qué es eso? <laughs> In Spanish, bro. Yeah? Like, mi entrenador me... How do you say shoot, bro? How do you say what? I'm trying to say shoot. You don't know how to say... You just asked him, bro? This is I know, I'm asking Bradley over here, Spanish know. teacher. I don't know. Le dio un balazo. Let me see the hickey. Wait, wait, wait. Wow, you're just way worse. Bro, she was a crazy one. Look, it just happened, though. Look, look, look. Oh, damn. Wait, low key. Wait, hold on a sec. Am I bleeding? No, you just like Loki allergic to the salt or something. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, he's just worse. And I just shaved too, bro. Yeah, that's why. That's that uh, might be one. You shaved this area? Yeah. Yeah. That's Damn, bro. What's on your shirt, Steve? Roddy. So we need to get like. We're gonna take this footage. Yeah. And then when Steve gets like shredded, yeah. we're gonna have him doing the same thing. I don't wear the same outfit. Same shirt. Same shirt, same outfit. How much more shirt are you gonna get? 15 more pounds. A fat? Yeah. Pure fat? No, pure fat. It's going all the way. No muscle? No, no muscle. Yeah, like no muscle? No muscle, bro. No, he's gonna burn no muscle. Like he has no muscle? I have no muscle, bro. Look. Damn. Tiny, bro. Muscle from? My dad. Oh, your daddy gave you the yellow hat, bro. Genetics, bro. Oh, this, show them again, one more time, so they're sure. <laughs> Genetics, <Yeah>. bro. <laughs> yeah, that's this thing, the first time. The first second? This thing's bad. It's oh, Hey, instead of working out, why don't just uh, go eat tacos? Go eat tacos. Steve. Eat tacos, bro. Steve, you're supposed to say no. I'm on. Uh, I'm on this. He's like, no, get, I'm on tacos. a diet. I'm on bro, a get, it's tacos. Like, I'm gonna get bro. get lean program. Tacos. You're, you're supposed to say no. I'll get get shredded tacos. Get shredded where, tacos. Where did they make them? Oh, wow. I didn't mean to put you in the hair. Bro. What did they make? Where did they make that? Hey, did the camera catch that? What? Did the camera catch that? I don't know. Maybe. Guess what? Bradley hit me, bro. Him in the head. Probably. Damn, the real Bradley Martin. Damn, bro. Savage. Steve's a savage because he was like, yo, shoot me in the neck with a salt gun. A salt gun? You're gonna a get salt assaulted? Gun and assault bro, weapon. you just got assaulted. Damn, Damn. bug assaulted. Bug assaulted, bro. Look, it's all windy and stuff outside. 
Yeah, it's, it's crazy. The wildfires right now are like burning up California. I know. There's three surrounding us. It's lit. It's lit. That's up. Damn. Damn. You said it, bro. I didn't. That's yeah, that's dumb. Get it. He said it. Should I go post that on Twitter if you like it's lit? Damn, it's no. Late. Is that too nah, soon? Don't do that. Too soon. It was, it was late. Roddy, what are you doing? He's trying to square up. You know in the Western movies where they square up? You know Western movies where they like... He didn't want to fight. We made peace. Yeah? Yeah, we made peace. Yeah, see? He's tired now. It's too much, uh... No, this is one of the best workouts we've ever had. I think it's one of the best workouts I've ever had. For sure. 100% one of the best workouts I've ever had. What do you think, Brandon? Yeah, my workout today has been kick-ass. See? <laughs> this is called the, uh... What is that exercise called? Uh, Floor Master 5000. Floor Master 5000. It's an OG machine. It's an OG, yeah. What, uh, what does it mainly work? Uh, lower back. Lower back. <laughs> Lots of lower back. A lot of lower back. All, 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 lower, back. Yeah. all lower back. All lower back. No, no, no glutes, no hamstrings. Just, just lower, back. lower back. <laughs> That's how you got your deadlifts up? Because you strengthen the lower back. So, um, yeah. It might hurt tomorrow morning, but it's always worth it, you know? Strain the lower hey, back a little bit. Steve's not BSing, bro. Oh, look at him. That's how you know a man is dedicated. Before, we're gonna keep working out right now, but look, look, what? <laughs> look, look at this tongue, look at this tongue. Look at this tongue. Oh my god. Yeah, he loves that. Oh my god. Alright, let's keep working out. Let's do this for real. Alright. What is this one called? Pull over hoodie? Pull over hoodie. Just like this? Every rep is like this. We're practicing like. Is it? Yeah, it's like this. Look, watch. <laughs> Alright. Hey, Steve. What? Oh, yeah. This is one of the best exercises. This is one of the best exercises. Yeah? Yeah. Hands down. That should be a thumb up, bro. Huh. What? Are you right now? You're feeling yourself? He's like, this should be a thumbnail. Look at me. Look at me right now. Amazing, bro. We already got the thumbnail, so you got getting shot. Yeah. No one cares about your progress anymore, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we wanted to see you do reckless stuff. Oh, you yeah. asking people to get shot? A sensitive topic right now in America, bro. <laughs> Damn, buddy. What? I'm like you're struggling. What? I'm too light. Struggling. Too light, bro. Huh? I don't know what you want to eat, bro. I'm down for whatever. Always. I'm trying to be on a clean diet right now because I've been eating crappy. I haven't had it in and out in three months. No, in and out. It's not clean. Me neither. Three months? No, oh, yeah. bro. Yeah. Oh, no. Seriously? I swear. Yeah. Bro, I've been eating so healthy. Ah. What'd you have last night? Salmon rice. Yeah? Yeah. Salmon what, bowl, rice. What'd you have yesterday lunch? I didn't have, oh, uh, chicken bowl. That's chicken bowl, rice. Pretty good. Um, I've been eating clean. Yeah? I've been Me getting too. lean, bro. Bro, I smell food right now. I'm huh? hungry. Yeah, dude, I'm so hungry. We gotta keep training, bro. Alright, I'll, I'll just see you guys at the food place. Alright, bro. <laughs> I'm just gonna start vlogging. What is this? What, what are on? you holding over there? Some new shit? Some new stuff going on here? Any last words before we uh, close out the the video? Uh, yes. Words of in uh, Very inspiration? Words of inspiration? Do you have any? Do you have That's any? That's in the beginning, bro. Have some in Spanish. Uh, <laughs> what? Something. What do you want to tell him? Like you could do it, si se puede, like. Si se puede, bro, really? Oh my god. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Oh my god. Um, That's a good one, though, right? Say something motivational, bro. Come on. Okay. I'll do it. Um, I was gonna say, coming out of here. Okay. 
All right, let me let me get settled. Um, damn, do I, what do I make it about? I feel like I gotta make it about my life because it's the easiest thing to talk about. Make it like by like the, the end of this year, your life. Reflecting. <sighs> I mean, that, dude, this year. Well, you can do better next year or something. Oh my God, I that's a different so video. That's that's the new year's video. That's a whole nother video because I can do a whole lot. Like this year, I learned so much, but. I guess what I can tell you guys give you some sort of like what is why is fire sinker? Just in case, bro. Because it's lit. Yeah. Not the right time. Not the right time to joke about this stuff. It's not also not the right time to. What are you doing, Kev? Kev, what is? God, let me focus. So listen, guys. All jokes aside, um, I'm proud of what Steve's doing um, on a lot of different levels because I think mentally changing your body is by far one of the hardest things to do. Mentally. Not even physically. Mentally, mentally change your body. So. Because there, there's so much more to it than just like coming here and doing workouts, doing exercises, doing things like it's the the thing that everyone always talks about, the thing that everyone always like asks about, or like the thing that even I struggle with, um, and not not even saying even I like it's not normal because it's normal. I struggle with this often, but this year I struggle with it so much. Finding internal motivation to like to keep pushing to be better. And that's like the biggest thing when it comes to any goal, like fat loss, building muscle, getting stronger. It's like you always get to a point, you always get to that like plateau, that stopping point. And you're just kind of like, nothing's working. Everything seems to be like, you, keep, you seem to keep hitting a wall. You get back up, you hit a wall. You get back up, you hit a wall. You get back up, you hit a wall. And I just want you to know that like that's normal. And it's like, it's part of the process to get over it. If you hit the wall 10 times, 15 times, 20 times, two times, however long it takes, just know that like, as long as you keep getting up and, and like trying to learn from like, you hit that wall, you, you're gonna be able to get better. And the thing is, it's a, a lot of times it's not like physically, not that you're not physically ready to pass the wall, it's you're, you're not mentally ready. So people get to that wall and it's like, oh, but if I just keep training, if I train harder, if I train this, it's not always about that, it's like, uh, there's mental stuff, especially when it comes to like strength and when it comes to like the whole thing of losing weight, right? You're trying to lose weight and it's, it comes down to like the food at the end of the day and you're, you're mentally like, oh, I want to eat this. I'm going to eat this. You're in an environment where people are eating and you're like, oh, I want to eat this. It's the mental thing of like, I'm not going to do this because these other things, this goal is more important to me than doing this right now. So that's what I'm talking about, the mental aspect. You hit the wall, you hit the wall. You're going to keep learning that it's not always just about the physical stuff that you're doing. It's about like you saying no to some food. It's about you saying like this is possible when you go to do like hit a PR. Um, or at the same time, when you're like, when you're struggling, it's like the last few reps. Like even if it's not a PR, it's not heavy weight. It's just like, you know you got two more reps, you're fatigued because you've been dieting. Mentally, like are you gonna push through those last few reps to get the most out of it? So it's a mental game. Everyone's like, you see physical, you see like the result, you see the outcome, but at the end of the day, it's mental. So yeah, something you get better at though. Yeah. Because you gotta, if you take that first step to like telling your mind that, and you keep doing it often, that's when you start getting better at it. Like that's training. what I noticed with me. That's what I noticed just, with me. Well, everyone, I'm pretty It's just sure. like training, like repetition. You get better at doing the things you do all the time. So it's the same thing. And for me, I like, I noticed that like, I, I stopped doing a lot of those things mentally, like those mental exercises of like, and I started like focusing on like negative shit, negative things. And um, that's what really, that'll slow you down more than anything. So my best advice guys is like, I don't know, maybe like every day take like a, and I need to do this still too, at the end of the day or the beginning of the day, I would say both, take like a mental like, uh, what's that word when you like, you check everything, like a mental like, check out or what? no, not check out, like a mental like, uh, like a register, take a register of like things that are in your life, like, a, like slow down and like appreciate kind of what you have. And focus on obviously the things you don't have and say, okay, I'm gonna be able to get these things, I'm gonna work on them today if you're thinking about it in the morning or when you go to sleep at night, I'll work on that tomorrow. So you can get like good rest and like little little basic things that like I don't think a lot of people think of when they're going towards goals, like getting enough sleep. I know something that like you know, like the eight years of like grinding, working, grinding, working, grinding, working, like sleep was something that was just kinda like it was secondary to like all these goals and like my mind would just run and once I learned how to like separate things mentally like oh, I'm gonna stop uh, and I'm gonna let myself go to sleep right so I'm gonna like I don't know allocate this time not being able to go to sleep because all my thoughts and all that stuff and then you told me just you know save for the next day kind of yeah, thing, the thing is, don't people, let it get people don't realize like 
not even necessarily how important just like sleep and stuff is, but like, like controlling your thoughts, putting them in place. It's like compartmentalizing like the things, right? So you can like, so you can get good sleep, so that you can know that like the things you want to accomplish is still going to be there tomorrow. Granted, obviously, God willing, you wake up tomorrow. But like, if you don't, everything will start to get just like jumbled together, and it can be too like overwhelming. If you're not like, okay. I'm gonna focus on this tomorrow. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna get these good hours of sleep. Like this isn't, cause that's important for the rest of your life, for the rest of your process, the rest of the goals, everything else you wanna do. And I think like little things like that get overlooked cause people focus on the big picture. And I know I used to do that a lot when I was younger. It was all about the big picture. Everything was like, oh man, I wanna do this. I wanna do this, I wanna do this. And I, and I failed to realize like, okay, well I have to do these like five little things to get to this, this one big thing. And then these 10 little things to get to this one big thing. And I always just kind of look at the big things and then, when I realized, like, oh, let me take a step back and focus on these little things right now today, the big things kind of took care of themselves. And that's kind of what I'm trying to say, like, get enough sleep, little things like that, but they all add up. And just as much as we said, like we said, as much as you train your body, you got to train your mind to be able to be like, this is possible, I could do this. Like, and when you hit the wall, figure out why you hit the wall and try to learn and adapt. Even You might hit the same wall five times, but you get over it quicker the sooner you like figure it out mentally, not always physically. So that's really it. Yeah, that was good, bro. For sure.